Hello again, I made a few more changes to my program to neaten things up. I added tabs to the order entry boxes. Uh, instead of having two, I made them, well, I still have two, but uh, they're now tabulated. So you can switch back and forth between stocks or you can still um, add stocks or whatever. And when you do that, the tab will change to the name of the stock symbol. Um, another thing I added was the stop order entry uh, boxes. They're now tabulated too. So if I had a position, say in Netflix, and hit this button here, the tab would change to the symbol and put a stop order in there. Uh, trailing stop at 30, you can change that here. 10 cent trail now. Um, another thing I added was a menu, um, risk value. You can change that to whatever amount you want, say 15,000. Um, and then you can hit this SS thing here and the quantity will change to reflect the amount. Um, just like that. Another thing I added was a share size box um, you can set that to 100 shares or 200 shares basically prevents you from uh, buying too many shares like say if you had a thousand shares you had bought uh, on Netflix and forgot to change it and you went and bought a thousand shares of Tesla by accident um, it would uh, set the share amount back to a hundred after every trade you make in case you forget so it prevents that from happening um, please like and subscribe thanks for watching 